Hey guys, I'm Bato Jackson, and today I'm going to show you again how to jailbreak iOS 4.3.3 and anything between 4.3 and 4.3.3, as well as 4.3.3. Okay, so what you're going to need is our Red Snow RC15, and I will have a link for that in the description. And yeah, this works for the iPhone 4 GSM model only the iPhone 3GS and the iPod Touch 4th gen and 3rd generation as well as the iPad 1. So go ahead and browse for your custom firmware. In this case mine would be iPod 4. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. iPod 4 comma and yours may not be iPod, it may be iPad. I don't really know what it would be. So mine is, it must be 4.3.3 as you can see right here go ahead and open it and then it should be processing the firmware right here as you can see sorry for the bad quality but i'm probably going to get a new camera very soon go ahead and click next and it should process the kernel preparing jailbreak data and patching the kernel may take a little while. Okay. Um, it should automatically have install city and enable battery percentage. Go ahead and if you want to, go ahead and click enable multitasking gestures and I'm going to click allow boot animation and enable multitasking gestures. As, it, as you can see right here. So go ahead and click next and make sure your device is powered off so go ahead and power your device off if it is not already off let's go ahead and hold the home button slide to power off yeah we're going to do this beforehand we're going to enter DFU mode and how to enter DFU mode is very simple just hold down the power button for three seconds like so hold down for three seconds then once that three seconds is up hold down the home and home and power button for total of 10 seconds then once that 10 seconds is up release the power button hold down the home button for total of 20 seconds so let's go ahead and do that okay one two three one two three four five six seven eight 9, 10, release power button, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, okay, should be done, go ahead and click next, and it should automatically bypass, and then it should be exploiting with the Lime Rain exploit. Loading, waiting for reboot, and this, and your iPod should look like this. Downloading jailbreak data. It will focus. I guess it's really bright. And then all this should pop up, and it should be. And Red Snow should be finished. Go ahead and click finish, and I will meet you back when it is finished. Okay, once that part is finished, it should look like this, installing custom bundles, and there should be a little pineapple guy with legs. So I'm going to go ahead and it should be rebooting now, and I'm going to go ahead and meet you when it is finished. Okay, I just finished rebooting now. Go ahead and slide to unlock, and then on the side over here, there should be a little icon, and then it should be Cydia, and that is Cydia right here, and yeah. And if you clicked in, um, enable multitasking gestures, you can click on anything. Just I'll go ahead and click on settings, and then I can use four or five fingers. I can pinch four fingers to close the page. It will close, and if I swipe up with four fingers, then the multitasking bar should come. And if I am in settings, and I scroll over with four fingers, I can go to different things. Go ahead and scroll back, and I should be on YouTube now. Okay. So I hope you liked the video on how to jailbreak iOS 4.3.3 and under. It goes down to 4.3.
re using Red Snow RC15. I will have a link in the description. And uh, thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye bye.